A Navajo family may never get over the traumatic death of Ashlyn Mike, the little girl murdered last year after a stranger lured her into his van. But they might now find a sense of closure. Her killer, 29-year-old Tom Begay Jr., will spend the rest of his life behind bars. News 13's Jackie Kent has the details after today's sentencing in federal court. Jackie. Dean, the Albuquerque Division of the FBI calls it one of the worst tragedies to hit the Navajo Nation in recent memory. How could any sane person do what he did to my child? Sentencing came down this afternoon. Tom Begay Jr. will spend life in prison for luring the girl and her nine-year-old brother in his van in Fruitland last May. He drove them out to the desert near the Shiprock Monument where he sexually assaulted Ashlyn and beat her with a tire iron. He let the boy go. Ashlyn's mom is pushing for more protections for Navajo children, like passing legislation to bring the Amber Alert system to tribes in the U.S. I hope that out of this tragedy, we can learn that our Native American children deserve the same protection as children in the cities. The next step is for the Senate to pass it. As a tribute honoring Ashland after today's sentencing, people outside the courthouse released these balloons. As for Begay, the feds did not push for the death penalty in this case because the Navajo Nation is against it. Dean, back to you. All right, Jackie, thank you. Now, Begay had changed his plea in August, admitting to kidnapping and killing the then 11-year-old girl. Of course, the family says the younger brother is still very traumatized. The man